Welcome back everybody and to a new Let's Play Sim Airport and we are actually, there's a bit of excitement actually happening here because there have been an update I and because this game is actually, they're actually still updating fairly, fairly often. So now they added this fuel station and I have no idea how it works. It's, it's pretty expensive though. I'm just gonna prop, put one down there and probably need a fuel port as well. What to work like so? I don't know exactly what it does. Right click fuel. I don't know why it's doing that. I don't. I don't get it. Not connected to underground fuel pipe network. Yeah, but it will be soon. Okay, and we have the percentages, so we can see how how far they are in the building process. Increase that one. And it seems like we're still selling fuel, so that's great. And uh, okay, and actually, uh, some new things happened. Uh, I'm not sure qu quite why. You can see some of our staff got a makeover, and the people look different. And uh, there should have been some improvement. They actually like look like people now. Before it was like. I don't know which, mo which model I like the most. This is okay, fine. The improvement, if there have been any kind of improvement, I would welcome that. And you can see here, you can also... I don't think we could do that before. Look at the individual passengers and like look at their needs. Environment, huge. Bottom. Look at uh, environment. The environmental. Otherwise, I think you can look up here and see what they needed. So, yeah, but still, some new improvement. I don't know how this network. Don't know if that works. That thing. We'll get have to keep an eye on that, and as well as the fuel. Still looking for the fuel. Still want decent fuel price. I don't know if that changed. I don't know. Oh, just a quick auto save. But I thi think the fuel ports. Yeah, they actually work. I think before they didn't actually work. It was like they didn't use them at all, so I think now they do. A fuel station, I don't know even if I turn it the right way or anything like that. Stuck? What? Now unstuck, okay. And also we got the ability to purchase land on all sides now. That's something we needed. And our new runway over here has completed so we will have to upgrade that upgrade I want to build one of these we might as well just max it out upgrade as well and I want to build one of these there you go now with with an extra runway I think we will do fairly well Still seems like how is the delays doing like for today? Were they delayed? I don't know. Departed. I don't think so. No, I don't they don't seem so. They change the color here. Depart. Actual departure. Okay, a bit late. Also here. So. Hmm. Tomorrow, let's look at that. But it seems like everything's green out here. I think that's the important thing. And then change some things. So now I'm not sure how everything is. Also, they changed the capacity of our fuel. Like, look at this. We can also now expand on that side. That's pretty interesting. And how is our fuel storage going? Okay, we're coming. It seems like the fuel is much more like stable in price it seems a lot more fixed it doesn't seem to fluctuate that much so that's like pretty great I guess I don't know maybe ma makes the things a bit more interesting and also we can have a lot I think our storage has increased, increased, and increased as well and you also get the opportunity to like 
went immediately deliver uh, your fuel for just 5,000. Might be worth it. <coughs> so, again, that's an advantage there. I don't know what this does anyways. Like it seriously is, it provides your full truck with access to the fuel in your net network storage tanks allows fuel services to be offered by your airport. I have that. I have fuel services and it seems to be working, but maybe we need one of these before it can work at all. So now we have one. And we have a giant plane here coming in. A new plane. How does this look? The security session department. Yeah, security looks fine. And that's the conclusion and we have to look out for delays. Seems like everything is going according to plan for now. And I just and also changed credit with credit report. Credit research. Okay. Maybe that's some new research. Yeah. We have actually got lower poverty tax. Should we research this? You can see the fuel barely moves. It hasn't moved at all. Actually, it takes a bit of fun out of it. Maybe. I don't know. Baggage shop. Hmm. Baggage shop boosters. Advanced security. I want to research the credit. Maybe. What over property tax? How much do we actually pay in taxes before we... I'm a, I'm a bit concerned because... Now, because of the new update, there's a lot of thing I don't things I don't know. And you can see as well, it's like our income decreased a lot. Because they made the changes to the fuel. But again, that was probably also a bit overpowered. I think. And now we have to rely a bit more on our, on our flights here. We could also go in and just... Where do we have uh, this? Also the prices, I think that would also do quite a bit. But I, I will try to keep those low. Hey. Don't get stuck. I think they cannot move. There's not ro enough room for them to move. I thought that two runways would be enough, but probably only come only for the small for smaller planes like this guy he takes up like four lanes I guess or three lanes and he takes up two and he just takes up one not quite sure <coughs> how are the refueling going now we're gonna have some refueling here at gate fuel level Okay. We sold a bit of fuel, but not a lot. We barely is estimated to do anything, and the fuel price at the mo this moment is pretty low. Will it go low? I don't think so. Seems to be staying around this this price. Okay, so our like our money method before did not quite work. You can see we're earning a lot less money at this moment at the moment and we haven't bought any fuel we actually just using fuel at the moment so mm, might take like the pace out of our little let's play here a bit but i think we can do it because we were actually on our way to making a new kinder expanding his way or but the addition of expanding other ways is also pretty cool we could expand this way as well <coughs> make some changes to this part here, I guess maybe an extra road. Put down next road wouldn't hurt anybody. But still, we are still earning a quite a bit, of, uh, quite a bit of money. It's not too bad. It's not too bad. Uh, I think I would like. I think the fuel prices. Um, I I think they are a lot more stable. Oh, we have just had some unlucky rounds. We will have a look at it. I think I I think I will buy some. Just two hundred thousand liters. Buy. Oh, and they will just be pending. We don't need to rush it in. Oh, I bought it anyways. 
So what? It doesn't matter. Then we definitely have the fuel we need. And you can see the fuel price is a lot more stable. It already goes up. It doesn't seem to change that much. How is our departures? Bought it, bought it, bought it. It seems like everything went according to schedule. Still have two flights at the gate. Departing at time, before time, and also departing for time. I think the extra runway really helped a lot. Even though they don't seem to use it that much. Hmm, irritating, but then again, what can you do? Um, in order to keep up the money and make this interesting, I actually... I actually just put it like kind of a goal before, like I didn't have to raise the prices. But I think I will now. Simply due to the changes. And you can see here what's expected of us to earn now. A lot more. It took us maybe a down a percentage here. And how about taxes? Hmm, taxes, taxes. Net profit and yesterday. And I want to see how much we paid in taxes. Probably tax not and not a not a lot. So I think I will I'll not prioritize that at the moment. And I will have a credit credit reporting. Maybe buy some Yeah, why not? Backup boosters. Allow us construction of backup boosters for increasing the Okay, increasing the throughput of your hubs. Okay, we are doing that. We might as well. Runway intersections. Ah. Then you could... That would also be neat. And then it means we could buy this plot of land and have the runways intersect each other. Hmm. Not that bad of an idea, actually. Hmm. I will think about it now. Oh, the fuel prices was actually pret pretty low there. You could do this, and I think it will automatically like recap every evening. I think our fuel, yeah, is not that great. Only eight planes. We don't use a lot of fuel, so we don't. And the price is a lot more stable now, so we don't earn as much as we did before. But I think I think we will manage. Um, we raised the prices here, so I hope that will like compensate for a bit of the tempo in our little let's play here before before, because before this it actually went pretty fast and pretty the tempo was pretty high and that's pretty nice and I would love for us to yeah do better today and hopefully we will have some fuel fueling on our ways how are the fuel trucks doing just sitting idly by. Don't seem to be so much this guy fueled up. And and you can see. Yeah, I think we are doing a lot better today. You will earn a lot more money. I would love to have more of the big airplanes coming in. I really think they make a difference. Like in the income. But I was actually thinking up here putting down the foundation for for large shops not anything else just large hubs all the way down the side here maybe not all the way but surely to here that would that was like the plan here and maybe have some more flights coming in Maybe we should do this. Maybe we should just build this, move the flights from here over here, upgrade these, and yeah, just increase it that way and have more flights coming in. And hopefully we'll gain enough money too. We can increase this way, up this way, and maybe build two big ones more. Big. Or a, gi a giant hub for only large aircrafts. Could we do this here? I don't know if we have the room. Just building large hubs all the way down. But also continue out. Could build one large hub. I don't think that would hurt. 
anybody. Hmm, that's the tough choice. Okay, the fuel price is real low. It seems like it's it's still fluctuating, but not as fast. So, okay, so it does make some changes to the way we were going to play. Now it's much more beneficial to like have a lot st stacked up, and when the fuel price is real cheap, go all in because it's not not smart. You're going to see our capacity increased a lot due to the new updates which means that's probably what they are trying to go for how much do we have we still have a plenty of fuel so i don't think we need to buy anything i think we'll we will have to see okay we're still earning a bit more okay what can we do what can we do maybe we should I think we will. As this at this point of in time. No mm, just put down this guy. And add a taxiway here. And a taxiway here. And here as well. Large hanger. And we will need a some utilities out here as well. So I will need a baggage shop. And to do that I will need some underground construction. And probably something like this. Can I do this? And Do we need how f how wide is that? It is five. We'll just make that as five uh, as five as well. Go out five here. Go out five there, and and now I think it be is beginning to auto save. It didn't do that before either, so that's probably a good thing. That's pretty positive, I would say. Mm. But anyway, we are going to build this here and the fuel is really low we should probably buy as much as we can now it's not that important at the moment still have plenty <coughs> or we should just buy up and uh, let's see and I want to make the foundation here and that's a six by seven that's the foundation for these guys six by seven there you go I want to upgrade these as well at some point we could probably invest in one more and look at that fuel price Increase this one. Come on, increase. And fuel price go below zero. And we will just buy uh, as much as we can. I think in order to have a bit more activity on the fuel front, we will lower the pl prices a bit to something like this. And I think we'll still earn a lot of money on it. And you can see we already that helped a lot. We'll go down to this. Now we have half the planes at this price. We'll be asking for fuel. Maybe that's a bit too much, I think. Yeah, eleven planes. That's better. And we will buy maybe three hundred three hundred liters. Can't afford that. Now I can, I will buy that. And just have that pending. I don't think it will matter that much. Let's hope we get some refuel soon. Do we have any fuel coming in? Yeah, we have fuel there. Blocked. 
like this. There we go. And I think we will be trying to now that the fuel isn't as profitable as before. I think we will try to expand more. What can you say on? Yeah, on the. Mm, yeah, on the. What's it called? I don't know. Yeah, on the. Yeah, I'm blabbering. I'm a bit tired as well today. I uh, had a long day at work. But anyways, um, I am trying to do what I can here. Um, we will be trying to focus more on air travel actually this time around. And uh, what? And I didn't place these like we did the others. So because of OCD, I will have to remove those. And look at the price. Now we will buy as much as we can. So the prices at this point in time are much more like, if you ask me, a lot more stable. And don't. And. Yeah, don't change that much. So. Much more stable use. Of fuel prices. So. They don't. It doesn't take a day for it to like go down and you can just wait the day out and and buy a fuel. Maybe it's going a bit too small, s slow at the moment. Maybe a bit faster, but it doesn't matter that much, does it? Uh, and also we did research a positive fact that airport well credit, credit history. Dead twin gun. We have a bad credit history. That's and our credit score is <laughs> negative. <laughs> okay. <coughs> Finance staff. Repayment history. Okay, maybe. I don't know. We only have this credit history. Minus 3% debt to income. Uh, that's probably because you're not earning enough money. But look at this, how much mo money we're earning now. I think that's okay. Still want to buy up as much fuel as we w as we possibly can here. And sufficient funds. Just need to zero by pending. I would just want to fuel up. Assign this guy and this guy can you unsign to this all the way down there I think you'll have to as we don't earn as much money as before it will take a bit longer to just complete everything we want to complete should we do this or just wait for the fuel just buy fuel at this point oh, I don't know it's a hard choice it's a hard choice I think we will I want to have this one operating because then I can. Oh, we need a door. Second floor. Did did they add more floors? I th no, I think there were third floor before as well. Door, large sliding door. They changed it like some of the models a bit. Okay, we didn't. Now we are in a deficit. Not that great. It doesn't help on our credit score. But again, we have plenty of fuel here. And we are being filled up to the top. So filled up here. Lovely to see. But when this truck comes in, the fuel delivery truck is just blocks everything. Luckily it comes in at night, so it doesn't really matter at one that much. At this point in time, I would we'll be looking to maybe redirect all of D1 traffic to G1. So we will be moving D1 traffic to G1. And why would I do that? Because I want to upgrade 
from that gate to one of these gates so we can have because as far as I understand these gates the only difference is they don't require a large door two stairways and that we have the same like cost for running the gate in the time we still need two staff members and at these case gates we can have larger airplanes coming in and larger airplanes means more passengers more passengers means a more money and we still need a door here to us get this fixed and but how much money did we make yesterday <coughs> almost a million so I'm not worried at all maybe a bit of because of the fuel price because that's not a lot of planes so I would like to slightly lower this here have 15 planes instead requesting fuel at that price that's really cheap so I think we need a large sliding door request at least one gate agent just to be assigned requires a door yes now we have this thing and, and this traffic will be redirected in the next turn so not this turn but the next turn and should we can we buy one more yeah we can I think we actually want to do that I don't think we want to I know we want to do that increase that as well how much can we buy can we change that to one and just buying urban fuel because the price seems to be pretty low at the moment hopefully someone will request refueling soon we can just zoom out a bit and look at all the airplanes coming in here come on refuel change on you guys not that large what about you actually pretty pretty, de pretty decent can we have a chance of this guy refueling? Come on. Refuel. Like the price also now has a, a much higher indica indicator of what the refuel chance will be on flights as well. And now a huge airplane again. Is and also the huge airplanes, the larger airplanes, seems to have a higher refuel chance as well. And now we have a lot of refueling here, so I think. I'll just pause before the prices go too high and buy fuel. And you can see it changes. Here we actually have an all average price above one and without it we have under and, and that's kind of our goal about the one mark. So that that changes things. So we now do this and this as well. And I want that's the seven. There you go. Increase that, and we want the door. How fast are they? There, go, there they are. There they are. You have to build this up first. I want to have the walls up first. Okay, I was wondering. Like, I have twenty workmen, and where are they all? I was like, what is going on? And there you go. Walls, walls, walls. Stair down. Desk agents. Do we only uh, only also have one room? No, we actually have two. Like I put those there, and so I'll probably cancel these. And just put them right there instead same thing with for these guys put them one step out instead and now this is not assigned to anything so a bit unpopular here I guess assign 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 to this one and this one, and again the sign down here because we're not finished with our little project yet. How much fuel are we requesting? Two hundred thousand. Average price still okay. 
and foundation increase there you go 200,000 I think we are going to make it we are going to sign a baggage shop actually two baggage shops up here and then we are going to upgrade these to have fuel ports as well just to be on the safe side because we don't want to miss out on our fuel opportunities that would be bad there we go also costs money of course everything costs money nowadays assigned to this and assigned to this and I want some extra staff here to go up the new positions and we want again now we have a new airline so I want to move these down here and I think actually they will do this they will go to this they will go up here this the next day I think I made it so Where are the staff people? Is the big question. I hired some extra staff. They should also be getting in the way. There they go. There they are. Looking great. Looking great. And yeah. Building on the underground section here. So we can have our new baggage shop over here. Connected to this one over here. And... Uh, Everything seems to be going as planned. And we actually need an extra baggage shop hit down here. So we will as well just increase. I think we have to increase the foundation. That's pretty huge. But anyways, I think we have to do that. And look at the fuel price. Just dropping. I think we will buy some more fuel. Now we have the opportunity as well. Can we afford it? Nope. Not that much, so we're just gonna go with this, and I think that will be like the end of this episode. And I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please leave a like and hit that like button and subscribe. It really means a lot to me. So yeah, I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Bye.